Hey guys, just wanted to make this quick tutorial video to show you guys how I record video games, video game walkthroughs, and upload them onto YouTube. This is going to show the entire process of how I record videos and upload them onto YouTube. So um, here we are with our uh, hop hug. This is what I use to uh, record all of my uh, all of my games. Um, this can record almost any console, I believe, as long as it has a uh, an RCA output. Um, I use it to record PS2 and PS3 games. Um, it can record in HD, so it can record a PS3 and an Xbox 360 in HD. So if you have one of those consoles, you might want to consider um, getting that, the Hophug HD PVR. It, uh, it's around 200 bucks. Um, you could probably get it online or maybe, I don't know, you might be able to get it from a store like Best Buy or something. Um, anyways, I'm about to uh, show you guys the setup of the Hophug and I'm going to show you guys a few other things. So I'll see you there. Okay, so here's the uh, Hop Hug HD PVR. Um, let's take a look on the back. As you can see, there's a component input and output, which is what you use to record in HD for your PS3 and Xbox 360. Uh, it has a few other things, such as the uh, the power supply, you know, a few other basic stuff you need. And on the front, um, it even has a regular standard def input, you know, RCA. So if you have uh, an RCA, maybe a PS2 or some older console, you could still use that, but it doesn't record in HD, which kind of cancels out the whole reason why you would get a $200 capture device. So um, really, it's pretty simple to hook up. All you have to do is use your uh, component cables. These come with the Hop Hug HD PVR. That comes with the Hop Hug, and... Um, you can use those component cables to plug into your TV. Now, to record in HD, you need an HD TV. You um, take note of that. Um, so, you also need a component PS3 or Xbox 360 cables. I have these uh, PS3 component cables. These actually uh, these work on uh, PS2. So, I actually use this cable to record both my PS2 and PS3. So really, um, all you have to do is plug all these in to uh, the back, into the input and output. I believe the, uh, the bottom is the in and the top is the out. So I'm going to plug it in and I'll see you guys there. Alright, so this is what your setup should look like. Um, Here's the component cables fr coming from my PS3 into the hop hug. That way I can record the PS3. Um, and here's the component cables going out to the to the your uh, TV. That way you could play games while you're recording. That way you don't have to go through any DVD recording crap. Um, this is the uh, the USB port which uh, plugs into your computer. That way you can record it onto your computer. And here's the power which you could plug into your walls that way your uh, hop hug is up and running so uh, that's about it for the hop hug there's also a few other capture devices you can use such as the dazzle I've got one right here um, here it's a really simple capture device uh, it only has one input take note of that it's pretty cheap it's only like 60 bucks um, but then again it, you can't really um, it's not really good for recording games if you um, want to record straight onto your computer, I guess this would work, but you know the quality is kind of crappy and um, there's no splitter like the hop hug. So um, you'd, you'd need a, a TV splitter to uh, split the signal into your Dazzle and out to your TV. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a pain if I wouldn't really recommend the Dazzle. I'd probably just get a standard uh, capture device like this. It probably doesn't even need to be HD. But this one is around 200 bucks. I think I already mentioned that. But yeah, it's. I'd totally recommend the Hop Hug if you're a little cheaper. Um, then I'd recommend the uh, the Dazzle. So uh, up next, I'm gonna explain to you guys how we rec I record uh, my commentary.
Okay, so this is the original device I use to uh, record my commentary um, for the games I do. Um, it's actually, I, I prefer this way better than my new way of just using this uh, standard mic. Um, it's b simply because you could use a, uh, a regular stage mic. That's actually, uh, it produces better audio quality. And here you can see it has a RCA output. So actually, I um, plugged this in to my um, hop hug and just recorded right off of this onto my hop hug. That way, I did not have to sync up the commentary with the game. And, well, it, yeah, it was a lot more easy to edit that way. But, um, you know, this, this uh, had a lot of problems. For example, it didn't really record as loud as the game. And, you know, I had to turn down the game volume a lot. But yeah, this was a, a nice way to record. I probably wouldn't recommend this way since it's really expensive. Um, this this device is around 80 bucks. You know, I got it for free because I my dad works in this kind of stuff. Um, so here I have a um, a regular Logitech mic. You can get these anywhere, I guess. It's a USB, so um, you can just plug it right into your computer. I'd recommend this way to record commentary. It may not be as easy because you have to sync up the audio with your uh, your game. But yeah, that's a nice way to record. I'd, I'd probably go with this way. Okay, so we got our hop hug all set up here. Um, I actually had the setup a little wrong before. Um, that top is the out and the bottom is the in so uh, we got our PS3 component going into the hop hug and then we got these component cables going out to my TV and then we got our uh, USB running straight all the way over to our computer ready to record and we got our, uh, our power supply so then our hop hug is up and running and it has power so now that we got that all set up then uh, you can finally record it on your uh, PC. Um, Hophug uh, comes with this software called ArcSoft. It's a, it's a really good software, even though it crashes a lot on some of the older computers. Um, here I've got the capture screen up. Uh, ArcSoft is a really good program. You could burn DVDs. I've used that before. You could uh, record video and even convert videos. So yeah, it's a really really useful software another reason why you should get a hop hug so uh... here we can record capture you can change up the settings um, since i have a really powerful pc nowadays um, i actually put my format settings here i can set them to probably the max settings you probably can't really see that well there we go uh... quality i i boost that all the way to thirteen point five um, you probably can't do that on a regular computer, but I got this new computer recently. It's a really, really powerful computer. Um, so, my old computer that I actually had before that, um, I actually had to record at something like 5 Mbps. Here I got at 13.5. So yeah, it used to be all the way down here at like 5 or 4 because that's the only ones my uh, my computer can handle. Okay, so uh, you just capture your video. I'm only going to capture this small little test clip. There it is, it's capturing. Um, when it's capturing, the, the hop hug light ups and glows like that. So you could go ahead and play your game, whatever, you know. And then when you're done recording, you hit stop. Oh, and one more thing, um, to record commentary while you're recording the game, um, you're going to have to use a audio recording program. Um, I use Audacity. It's a really good program, and it's, uh, it's free. It'll record my uh, USB headset, so I could just use that to record. So while I'm recording this, I hit record for the, uh, the Audacity. So I'm recording two things at once.